Hello Ramo Crypto Army, welcome back to the channel and today I'm just going to touch on a little bit of the talking points. I would just got finished wrapping up looking at the the AMA uh, that was on his Twitter space with Russ in the gang. Um, so uh, yeah, as always it's not financial advice, okay, so please do your own due diligence before investing. Hit that like, subscribe and notification bell so you guys can get all of my content when it is uploaded. Okay, so look guys, I know they're going to be... <laughs> I know that there are going there is going to be uh, some chaos uh, chaos after this uh, Twitter space, uh, especially f uh, from the fudders out there. Okay, now say the realty, it is being pushed back to Wednesday. It was supposed to come out uh, tomorrow, uh, which is Tuesday, but it is coming out on uh, Wednesday. I think around uh, 5 p.m. Eastern, if uh, if uh, I'm not mistaken, I think. But, um, you know, what this does, because uh, the app will also be uh, live Tuesday, which is tomorrow around 1 p.m., it would also, it, that would give you guys enough time to uh, test out the app, okay? I have no problem with uh, Say the Realty being dropped Wednesday, but the app will be 100% live uh, tomorrow at 1 p.m., so that would give you guys, like I said, uh, it would give you the opportunity to play around and test out the app so you will be familiar with it when trading uh, starts, okay? At least for uh, Say the Realty on Wednesday, okay? Now, I know a lot of food is gonna come from that, all right, but that's to be expected. The reason why I'm not worried about that is because, um, you know, it's a process. I know what's going on, okay? I, I know how processes go, okay? But other than that, uh, you know, the team said that Say the Mass looks good, so that's a big plus. Okay, so that means when say the mass, uh, that means when say the mass launches, we should have uh, no problems, there should be no complaints. Although I know they will, even if they are some little bugs here and there, okay, at least, um, at, at, at least, at least we know that it's still a work in progress. Okay, so the team is also, um, ramping up uh, the liquidity injection, you know, they're injecting uh, liquidity. Okay, they talked about that a lot, and um, you know when you when you injecting that liquidity, you're getting uh, ready for a lot of those uh, pair ups. All right, and we they also uh, talked about like the uh, what else did they talk about? They talked about like the five percent uh, price impact, you know, which is actually going to make it uh, a fair launch for a lot of the investors out there. Okay, um, and like I said, the app should be one hundred percent. Uh, they were talking about some uh, some router issues also uh, that they had that they're working on. And I guess these are the issues that they're working on, uh, the reason why they also have to push, uh, say, the realty back. Okay, but we also have to understand that uh, the maintenance is the norm. Okay, you want to have daily maintenance. And it's better to have that now rather than uh, a lot of these bugs coming out, okay, uh, after say the mask goes 100 percent and they have to and then they have to keep shutting it down all the time okay uh, so we don't want that because you're going to get complaints uh anyway okay and you're also going to get a lot of uh maintenance okay especially when it's uh a lot of uh high anticipated traffic they're going to be a lot there's going to be a lot of high anticipated traffic going on to uh say the mask but like i said i'm not really worried about the food Okay, it's good thing that the it's a good thing also that the um, the dev team they're staying focused. Okay, they're not letting the foot uh, sway them. They're going at their pace to make sure that uh, the app is is 100% workable for us to enjoy. Okay, they want things to be perfect. Uh, this is not easy technology. All right, you guys got to understand they're creating their uh, they're creating a lot of of, of of things on their of their own. Okay, they're creating like uh, what their own router. Uh, and you know their own meme pool or mem pool to stop uh, a lot of the bot attacks out there There are not a lot of projects out there that's doing that. This is uh, complex stuff Okay, and I like the fact that Russ is listening to you know the engineering team. Okay, he's not rushing them He's allowing them to you know uh, Do their best work so they can give us their best work also. Okay, we want a 100% uh, 100% uh, completely working project, okay? Um, but the thing is this, you know, if, if Rush was one of those guys who rushed his engineers, okay, we would not have a completely working uh, app, 
you know, we will have a lot of bugs and there will be more complaints anyway. All right. So um, they've also talked about how they created their own bots to test against uh, the swap. And they said that went good. So that was great uh, to hear just in case any other bots come in there and want to attack the system or they find their way in there and, you know, attack the system. Okay, and they also talked about how to uh, say the realty address for individuals that's interested in purchasing, uh, getting in on say the realty. They talked about how uh, the address will be available 30 minutes before launch on Wednesday. Now, remember, I think it's launching at 5 p.m. Eastern on Wednesday. Uh, so uh, the address will be available probably some sometime around like uh, 4.30 or something like that uh, p.m. Eastern time. Okay, so you guys will have 30 minutes to get the address and figure out, uh, you know, also play around with the app. Like I said, you guys should be very well prepared, okay, when this app goes 100% and when Say the Realty uh, launch, okay? And they will also have another AMA uh, Wednesday at uh, 1, I think it's 1 p.m. Eastern time, okay? They will have another AMA at 1 p.m. Eastern time. So. Uh, you guys will have a chance to also get in on uh, the AMA uh, before a lot of that, uh, before a lot of the fireworks start popping off, okay, to better prepare you. I was listening to something that Scott Herman said on there, okay, Scott Herman uh, talked on the Twitter space and he said something about, you know, not tripping at the finish line. A lot of you individuals out there and investors, you have to have patience, okay, because if you don't have patience and you sell a lot of your projects before they take off, you tripped at the finish line. This is a lot of uh, what I talked about on my channel uh, for some time. Okay, so um, you guys keep that in mind. And also, uh, I did hear that there were uh, what, what what else did he say? He did say something about uh, Russ did say something about there will be uh, buying limits. Uh, okay, for example, uh, if you wanted to buy, uh, if you wanted to purchase, uh, and then this just this is just an example. Okay, uh, an example was if you wanted to purchase. You will be able to only buy like 10 billion or whatever the set limit would be and then your second purchase will probably be uh 11 billion or whatever that uh, uh amount is okay and then after a few buys like two or three buys or something like that you're going to have a cool down period okay which is going to which is going to allow um other buyers uh to come in and get in on uh uh purchasing say the realty okay that's that that right there is part of the uh the fair launch okay that was part of that uh that five percent uh price uh, impact that i talked about in the beginning of the of the uh this video right here i know i'm jumping all over the place but i'm trying to remember a lot of uh you know uh, what was said but that five percent uh price uh impact that would uh correlate with the the buy limits and you know like I said, that would give a lot of the other investors a chance to come in also. So, uh, you know, we don't have a lot of whales out there just trying to purchase everything. All right. Um, but, um, uh, yeah, like I said, this was uh, the Twitter spaces is basically a lot of what I heard. I was trying to remember as much as I could. And like I said, guys, it's a process. I know there's going to be a lot of food that is about to come right now because of, uh, you know, say the realty was pushed back. But like I said, I'm not worried about it. It's all a process. Uh, processes, you know, my eight years of experience told me what is involved with processes, okay? And like I said, uh, what goes on now does not matter. What matters is what, go, what happens in the future, okay? So um, I wanted to make this video, and I will catch you guys on the up and up. Howdy.